Hello again, my name is Rodney Reynolds and welcome to another video review. Today I'm looking at the Aspire X Super Alien Aluminum Case. At the front of the case there's a door. This door is lockable. It easily opens and closes. You can also remove it. Right here are five, five and a quarter inch drive bays, two, three and a half inch drive bays. The power button, reset button, hard drive LED and power LED are right here. Now further down in the case there are a number of things. In this area, right here at the very left, is a dial to control those fans at the very bottom front. By the way, there are two 80 millimeter fans which intake air down here. And this dial right here will control any fans you have inside the case. Also, an LED. This will show you the hard drive temperature and the CPU temperature, or really anything else that you have those thermal sensors connected to. Also two USB ports, one Firewire port, and audio. Now let's go further down here on the case and have a look at this removable grill. This is very easily removed. Of course to reveal those two 80 millimeter fans, and by the way all the fans in this case our LED fan so they will glow like this. Installing a five and a quarter inch drive in this case is extremely easy to do because behind each of these five and a quarter inch drive covers there are two sliders. You just slip these off very easily and screw them on to your drive. Once you've done that you can very easily slip the drive into place and it's installed. Now if you want to remove it just pinch on either side and slip the drive out. And installing three and a half inch drives in the three and a half inch drive base is extremely easy because it's completely removable. You can install what you need and then just slip it back into the case. At the top of the case there's an 80 millimeter fan with a nice looking alien grill. At the side there's a very large window and this window also has an 80 millimeter fan with an alien grill. It's also lockable. The handle right here pushes this way so you can easily remove that side panel if you want to install it. Just snap it back into place. At the back of the case at the very top is where the power supply gets installed. Now there is a special power supply and this is it. That's best suited to be installed in this case, but I will be covering this in the next video review. There are also two more 80 millimeter fans right here. These exhaust air out of the case included as well as an IO shield plate and down right here is where your sound cards, video cards and so on and so forth will be true through once you have the motherboard installed. Also there are two thumb screws which make it very easy to remove and install the side panel. Inside the case there's lots of room to work and this case does have a removable motherboard tray. To remove the tray unscrew two thumb screws. One thumb screw is located right here, the other one down here. Slip the tray this way, pop it off, install what you need and then slip it back into place. Push it this way and screw those two thumb screws back on. Very convenient and very easy. Something else that's very easy is the installation of the hard drives. You can install up to five hard drives right here. Each one of them has its own tray which is very easily removed. Install the hard drive. The hard drive front goes here and slip it back into place. Now note the orientation of the hard drive. The hard drive is this way instead of this way. In most cases it's this way and what happens of course the hard drive cables will stick out all over the motherboard and get in the way. It won't in this particular case. Also a number of cables here which lead from the front of the case for things like the power for the LED as well as the fans, the USB ports, firewire, audio, and all the motherboard connections. This case has a ton of features. It looks great 
and it comes in a number of different colors. Overall, this is a kick-ass product. Again, my name is Rodney Reynolds, and this has been another video review. Be sure to check back very soon. I will have a brand new one for you there. Also, pop up my website at www.3dgameman.com. And while you're there, you can go to the forums and register. And remember, registration is completely free. Also, keep in mind, you can find out a lot more on this product in the forums. Until the next time, take care. <laughs>